Hey, it's Josh with another episode of Wrong Way, Right Way. So, what are we trying to do here? Um, we're actually trying to solve a water problem in the basement, Minnesota basement, full depth. Um, they get water in here each time it rains. It's kind of a nuisance. So, uh, they've been dealing with it for years. Um, so, how do you solve water in your basement? There's a lot of things that can contribute to it, but um, what's the solution? Sometimes people think it's painting the floor with like an epoxy or a uh, waterproofing paint. Um, this one's had epoxy on it, as you can see. It doesn't really stick. That's because of that moisture coming up from below. So it doesn't bond like it's supposed to. Um, some people paint their block walls. Waterproofing paint. Looks like there's a couple coats on here. Along with this fancy green carpet. Um, but, those things might seem like a good idea. They don't usually work for liquid water um, when it's raining. You got cracks in your foundation. You got water coming in all around. Especially if your gutters are overflowing or you don't have the proper downspouts or they don't run to a good place where the water can get away. Maybe you don't have any gutters. Those can all contribute to it. So that water is gonna find its way through this paint, through this epoxy, through all this stuff. So what are you supposed to do? There's a lot of things you can try, but nine out of 10 times it's gonna to come to this. What you see here. So what we've done, is we've taken a cement saw or concrete saw and we've cut through the floor. This is the exterior wall. Cut through the floor all the way around the perimeter of this house or we're in the process of it. And we will excavate all this junk, all this rubble. Get that out of there. Take it out in buckets, load it up. Then we will dig down in this trench so basically this is the dirt under your basement floor now. We're gonna dig down about six inches and we'll take a piece of drain tile, run that continuously through. Drain tile is just a plastic corrugated pipe, usually four inch. It's got slots in it, it's perforated they call it. It allows water to run in and then flow to wherever it needs to go. Here it's gonna flow to a sump basket which is basically a bucket you bury um, with an electric pump in there so it'll fill up. The float senses the water filling up and it kicks it out. So it'll pump it outside actually and from there you wanna make sure that it's going somewhere where it can run away from the house. There's a lot of times when people will pump it out and it runs right back to the house. So that's an important consideration. This has been another episode of Right Way, Wrong Way. So if you want things done the right way and maybe you don't want to do the actual work, feel free to give us a call. 612-221-0965.